Good morning YouTube. This is just an update with some of the uh, stuff I've replaced and new gear. Well, hi there YouTube. Um, this is just a quickie. Uh, let you know what gear I've actually um, bought and swapped now and find out what we're doing. It's Ride with Derek, UK. Um, a lot of you know I had a little spill, some of you don't. I had a little spill back in June and hit me head on the road and damaged my arm in some of the bits of my clothing which has all been sorted. The bike got wrote off but I bought it back and rebuilt the bike. Uh, this is some of my new gear now. Uh, this is the latest Senna um, Bluetooth motorcycle bluetooth communication system with mesh this is it here it's their top of the range one it uh released uh, the back end of uh, 2019 and we had them in 2020 so i managed to get out of one and they're not cheap they're 309 pounds uh, they reckon they can go up to about seven or eight miles linking with the riders, so it should be a bit of a good kit. Uh, the speakers, they're HD, sound, quality, much improved. You get your uh, little bits and pieces, your clip, which I can't use because of my helmet, which I'll show you in a minute. Your sticky pad, there's two uh, round foam things in there, one for either side to bring the speaker system near your head. You get a little flat microphone, and I mean flat, it is flat. It's about, I'd say, the size of two pound coins put together. And then you get your boom mic. If you want to, uh, if you've got an open face or a module around it. And getting onto the helmet, I brought myself uh, an unusual icon, which is a US mate brand. They're up and coming now, very good. Got all the uh, ratings on. It's got a, a unique um, visor system on it. I'll just scan around and show you. Yeah. That's the colour. You have a spoiler there. As you, if you look that way, you'll be able to see it. Um, as for, well, you've got everything. It's all CE approved. It's the Aircon Flight QB1 in blue. Icon dot certified in ECU so it's uh, all been tried and tested um, what's that say there always securely fasten one chin strap when wearing your arm as if we didn't know how to do that yeah this is the uh, flight shield they call it it's an amazing uh, well I think it's amazing I've never seen anything like it in my life this is the visor all here I'll just uh, lift it up quick. Here we go. So it comes up. I'll put it down. And the whole lot lifts up. I'll do it from the side. So you might be able to see it better. It lifts all up like that. And you can ride with the peak up. So it makes it look like a peak. You can get different coloured visors, but they're not road legal in the UK. I was going to get the, uh, they call it Icon Blue RST Blue. That light of a little on the helmet. Uh, it's very good. We've got an amazing breathing thing here. This all opens up from inside. You can turn it so no rain gets in. And this helmet has also got a, I'll just show you now if you pick it up. It's got a, a drop down sun visor in it. So look at that. Bit like an alien sort of thing going on there. <laughs> anyway, I'll be fitting the um, the new Santa 550R mesh on the left side here. I don't know about the uh, drift camera. I'll have to wait and see because I'm in two minds forever to um, <coughs> excuse me <coughs> in two minds forever to um, go for a GoPro. So I can't have it chin mounted, so I'll have to have it on the side. So I might just stick with the uh, with the uh, drift. Actually, thinking about it, yeah, because the the visor comes here, so there's no way you'd have it. It'd be out here somewhere. It looks stupid. So you've got your air vents. 
front and back. I'll just try and show you inside. Let's come here a minute, let's put it here. Move, move the straps. Yeah, it's got its uh, special, special cutout on it there, so it doesn't interfere with your collar. I don't know if you can see that, which is a, a bonus. I'll come outside and hopefully you'll be able to see inside. It's got its own tubing system for uh, your head vents. So, very nice looking helmet, I think so. Some of you might not like the shape of it. Um, I must stress, um, when you're looking at these, and if you do look them up, uh, they're an helmet only for a, a person with a narrow face, not an actual um, roundy head, if you know what I mean. Mine's more an oval, narrow shape, like a peanut sort of shape. Um, well, you can see that by the looking of it. Um, now, normally, I'm a size uh, small in uh, helmets, and believe it or not, I was glad I rode over to the sports bike shop because uh, the small that I test and try and buy before I buy, they never had it in, they only had the medium and the medium wouldn't even go on my head. It was like, oh, pull my ears, pull my eyebrows, everything. So I ended up with a large, which is a perfect fit. Anyway, I thought I'd just give you a quickie update. And that's the Senna R50, as you can see all the bits and pieces there and the new icon flight helmet anyway there's some more stuff as well i'll just show you well, in a second change your room right the other new thing is is the uh jacket the rst jacket when it's zipped up it you know what i mean it looks okay uh this one is the uh tac trek evo r it's got the padding on the shoulders in the elbows in the back it's got all the pockets and um, here you have uh, the zip as you do your, your um attach it to your trousers or jeans whatever you're wearing with rts but with this one because it's the better range uh, you get the extra zip bit which you can sew into another jacket that won't uh, fit the rst zip because if you know rst has their own zips here you've got a big pocket as well perfect for air you've got air vents in there one in there same on this side so the air comes out the back which is good you don't blow up like a parachute that's the back of it and you've got here i don't know if you can see it you've got your rump you've got a hump there to the back which is more protection so it is a much better coat so i've gone better with this coat uh, replacement um trousers as well the jeans are waterproof which will attach to them and the next thing is uh my gloves i bought these ones these were 80 pounds proper gore-tex they'll be waterproof a mixture of leather and the gore-tex absolutely brilliant fitting plenty of padding on it and your fingers and you get a i don't know if you're going to pick that up where are we yeah there that line there if i put it down and point out that line here is a window wiper <laughs> for your visor and the next edition is the new t-shirts um, it's in the pipeline. I don't know if it'll kick off. It all depends how many people are watching the actual channel. Um, I'll be giving them away as uh, gifts. The more subscribers I get, every uh, 50, there'll be a free T-shirt, pick of the draw, or two or three, first, second, and third. So that's Ryby Derek, UK. If you're interested in a T-shirt, please subscribe and share and tell your friends to build the channel up and you might be lucky winner and win one so this is the update on the clothing i've just got to sort some boots out and then that'll be it i think thank you for watching